Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play This War of Mine. It's winter, again, well, not again, still, and we're trying to survive. So now, you're going to sleep in bed, we're going to scavenge. She's uh, slightly sick and wounded, and we're going to get Pavla to scavenge again while you guys guard. We're going to the semi-detached house, because there was quite a lot of stuff um, to trade here. They were giving us a lot of parts for uh, quite cheaply, which is exactly what we need. So, this is what we're going to take there. Can I take snow? <laughs> Let's scavenge. The problem is these small inventories. You can see there's a lot more space for inventory, but I don't know. Can you make some backpacks or something? That would really help. Now, we want to get into this area over here, which is blocked from this side and locked from this side. So, we need to get in. And this guy sells some... For peace and freedom. This guy sells a uh, lockpick here. So let's... Find we can have a deal. Let's do this lockpick. Go open that thing. And then we'll buy as many parts from him, him as we can. To see what we can do. This is probably locked as well, but... There we go. Ah... That looks much better. I'm going to close this, just in case. I don't think they'll mind, though. Oh, ho, ho, three food. Yep. Yep, that's what I'm talking about. Maybe some materials here. No, only trash. That's not good. But three canned food. That is brilliant. I want some stuff over here that I maybe can uh, sell or something. Have we already been here? Yes, you can jump down, so... Wait, wait a second. Is there someone here? Is that... That's a rat, isn't it? Yeah, we've already uh, done it, everything over here. But let's go back to this guy. See if we can do anything else. Or maybe... What do you mean you don't know how to reach that place? What? Haven't we been down here? Yes, we have. How did we... How did we get here? There's a hole there, there we go. I don't know why he said I, I don't know how to get to that place. There you go, that's how you get down. Look at that rat, I want to get it. But now we have to... Uh, we have to stay very quiet. Otherwise they'll be a bit angry with us. I don't want to go there, let's see what they have over here. Private... Pr wow, assault rifle. I'm taking that, sorry. I know it's stealing, but I'm kind of taking that. A working assault rifle? Man. I don't know if you can intimidate people, but, you know. And hopefully they won't instantly know that I've stolen from them. Hello? Can I still go and do stuff with you, or are you going to shoot at me? Right. Can I give him the weapon? <laughs> I think I could give him the weapon... Right. More cigarettes. And I want parts for that. Yep, there we go. Look look at how cheap the parts are here. It's ridiculous. Look at this. And I can still take cigarettes. Look at this. They are crazy for cigarettes. Brilliant. Can I get even more wood? Because wood seems to be, uh... Yeah, nope. Right, let's deal with that. Oh, I can't carry that much. Of course not. Ugh. Wait, I need wood. But less of these. Oh, come on. Seriously? They really don't like their... They really don't want parts, do they? One cigarette. You know what? I think this is a bug. Look at this. They're giving this away for free. They're definitely giving this away for free, but hey. It's good enough for me. This can't be right. <laughs> I'm coming back here. This is great. And we got an assault rifle, which we kind of stole, but hey. They've got lots of stuff we don't. Pavla is back. So there we go. As I said in the beginning, I didn't want to steal and do stuff like that, and now I've just stolen something, because I'm sort of 
desperate. Not really for weapons, although weapons are nice, of course. And if some intruders come, I mean, an assault rifle? Man, that's great. Hello, look at all this stuff. I wish I could bring back uh, so much every night. Yeah, this was indeed a very good haul. Seems that Arika is starting to feel a bit unwell. That's not good. Right, you go straight to bed. Um, Arika is going to bed. She's slightly sick. We don't have any medicine anyway because we sold it all. And Zlata is hungry, so you can go and do stuff. Well, you... Actually, Zlata, you're going to upgrade the heater. Oh, yes, we can upgrade it now. Let's make that. I'm hoping that will be worth it, because uh, I'm hoping it will use a lot less fuel. I've never seen an upgraded heater. That's going to be interesting. <clears throat> and hopefully it's still going to keep that two firewood I had in there. Otherwise, I'll feel cheated. And bang! Look at- oh no, it doesn't have the firewood! Give me back my firewood, man! It's minus five now. That looks, uh, yeah. Upgrade it. And it- you can't actually upgrade it more, so that's- that's fine. Do we have some wood? Yes, we do. I have no idea how much you can put in there. But hopefully it's gonna heat a lot more as well. Alright. Well, hey, we just go back to those guys and get loads of parts. Feels like cheating, but I still don't know if it's actually a bug or uh, not. Right, only one person hungry today, so that's good. We have five canned food and three raw food, so that's pretty damn good. Of course, we need water. Let's put one in there. Two, three, four. Okay, so it's... Oh, bloody hell! How much? I think I've just burned a book. Well, that's certainly going to heat things up, but I thought it said it would burn more efficiently. Well, it looks nice with the fire here. Oh, it's the kids again. Hello again. We're hungry. We're very hungry. Our tummy is hurt. We can't find anything good to eat, so we've been eating all sorts of gross things in the last couple of days. Can you share some real food with us, please? Pretty please? Yes. Yay! Thanks! Real food! I'm happy. I want to do this. There we go, we're content. A hungry child is a heartbreaking sight. I'm glad we gave them some food. And so am I. Nothing like good sleep. Let's see what Bruno says. No child should ever be hungry. We just had to share food with him. Uh, when this war is over, we'll throw a barbecue party. Invite all our neighbors and eat until we're stuffed. I agree. He's still sad, though. What does Arika say? We gave those children some food, but I don't think they'll make it through anyway. Oh, uh, yeah, that's quite... Sad. Oh crap, now we don't have... Well, we have to burn the book if we want to eat. But, of course, rather than burning a book, I think I want to eat some canned food for now. Yeah, but you can see how everything is sort of at a standstill now. You know. We don't have the materials to do... Well, nothing. We can't, uh, we can't melt snow because we have no firewood. We can't grow herbs because we have no water. We can't cook things because we have no firewood and water. We can't make hooch because we have no firewood and sugar. Well, we do have some sugar now, but no water. Um, I can't make roll-up cigarettes because I believe we have no tobacco. And of course, no parts because we use them all. Oh, well, I can make four. Hey, we'll bring them to those people again, right? And that's about it. There's nothing we can do. So we definitely need more stuff. Well, let's see. Anything else? Temperatures are still very low. In the besieged Pogoran, firewood is getting harder to come by and people are gathering anything that can be burned. More atrocities committed by the military. This morning, a mortar shell exploded in the crowded Pogoran marketplace, killing and wounding many people. Alright. So that's not good. It's not good at all. Soon it will be over. We'll be fine. Hopefully. Well, 
probably she's saying not a bad day she's saying that because she's content well if we look at this there's nothing we can do we have the sugar and water actually but no firewood so we could actually make some uh, by burning fuel hmm that's a very tempting proposition actually because we can sell the hooch it's 10 degrees now not too bad but not great let's make this make the hooch all right and then we'll just end the day because there's nothing else we can really do at the moment and the day right she's going to sleep because she's slightly sick and you're going to scavenge or maybe Zlata could no it's gonna be Pavle uh, guard and guard so we're going back to the semi-detached house because they've got so much stuff to uh, to uh, to trade which is kind of nice I could take some real cigarettes with us yeah, let's do that because our people will be uh, smoking this and we can we can get more for these although parts seem to go for nothing let's see if we, he would actually give it uh, give me parts for nothing <laughs> I doubt he would but uh, I like this place though we can make more deals hey you've got something you'll like all right let's see right He's got so much stuff. Look at that. What can you give me for that? There we go. Oh. <laughs> you can give me so much stuff. Okay. I want more of this. Oh. Ah, not enough now. Right, what else can I get for that? Maybe a filter? No. Uh, definitely can't get any food or anything. They've got loads of medicine and everything. Jeez. Uh, maybe some, some of this stuff so I can make some more cigarettes. Yep. Definitely need firewood, though. Oh, wait a second. Fine, we can have a deal. Hmm. Yeah, it's the same as wood, really, but, uh... Well, I need firewood. Either way. Hmm. Man, this sucks. I need a filter as well. Okay, let's deal. It's a pleasure doing business with you. Right, let's also go and investigate over there. But I'm pretty sure they're gonna be pretty angry if they find me there. I just gotta be careful. Because I think this leads straight up. Yeah, there is a door there, but... Okay, so this is locked. Never mind then. Never mind. That was nice though, with that uh, assault rifle. Alright. Well, it wasn't too bad, I guess. I mean, we have a lot of materials, a lot of uh, components, but uh, wood is really what we need. Firewood. That is kind of a problem. Loading. It's day 28 now. We've been raided. Someone tried to rob us. They really meant business, but we managed to fend them off. We had some weapons, but not enough for everyone. We used up three bullets to chase them off. Damn it. Pavla had been searching. Okay, let's uh, get you back to bed. Get you to bed as well. Oh, she's very hungry now, yeah. And Arika is now actually fine and very hungry. There we go, we've... Uh, they're not sick anymore, so that's good. So let's see, three very hungry people. Yeah, that's a problem. We have the hooch now. And still haven't caught anything there. Right, let's see. Um, well, we have no wood. <laughs> I can actually make a radio because we have so much... So many electronics and parts. Hmm. 
Right, what do we need? I could upgrade this as well, but of course I need 10 wood for that. At this point, 10 wood seems like a... Uh, you know, fantasy. And 20 parts. But we do have... Um, enough food. So Bruno... Bruno will be doing that. Bruno will be doing the cooking. Because he'll actually only use... Two. Uh, firewood instead of four for two cooked food. So that's quite nice indeed. Uh, well, nothing else we can do except make some cigarettes. To trade them. There we go. Let's make the homegrown tobacco. And then... Some cigarettes. There we go. Oh, I can only make one because I have one tobacco. Oh well. Four cigarettes seems to go a long way with the parts with those people, though. <laughs> and, I mean, we can always burn the parts, but of course you need, I believe, four parts? To make one firewood? Can't quite remember. We'll check. We will check. Let's see. Um, you need... Yep, four parts. That's quite a lot. A lot, lot. Actually, I'm not gonna do this. How much firewood do we need? Let's see. I mean, uh, uh, how much do we have? Oh yeah, we have two firewood already. And we can make more. Actually, never mind. We can't make more because we have no more wood. Hmm. So I can't actually put more into the stove. Well, the uh, heater, because we need stuff for food. And we need three food. So you're going to be eating from a can today, Arika. And Bruno is going to cook some food. Yep. Come up here. We're gonna eat. Oh. Oh. Never mind. I don't have enough water. Damn it. So, I'm guessing two people will be eating cans. Very hungry. Alright. Nom 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 nom. Nom. I wouldn't mind another helping. Well, that's as much as we can do, really. So, uh... We're going to end the day. I don't want to burn the components. I want to make some of these. Nobody coming to the door, so we'll just end the day. There we go. Let's end the day. And Arika will be sleeping in bed. You'll be scavenging. And you'll be guarding. Alright. So let's go back to the semi-detached house. And bring some cigarettes. And the hooch. I could give him the assault rifle as well, but... Let's scavenge. Yeah, let's, uh, let's bring him that to trade. Could get some more food, hopefully. But that's, that's interesting. I thought that um, all of the traders in the game would have the same prices. But, of course, it does make sense, you know, everyone... We'll have their own price, it's kind of nice. Whoa, 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 whoa! What the hell? What? what? What's going on? What the hell? I thought they were trading. Run to the exit, get the hell out of there. What the hell? I guess they knew that... We stole from them? I have no idea what was going on. No idea. That was bizarre. Stop, that's mine. They didn't ever see us take anything. Damn it. That really sucks. I guess they, they realized that we were robbing them blind. <laughs> From those parts. Well, Arika clearly isn't well. I will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.